Hi, I'm Sharon. Hi, I'm Ricardo. And today on the show, we are going to be celebrating African American History Month. So we are going to make some instruments, um, some African inspired instruments. What you will need to participate in this exciting activity are various types of paint brushes, paint, water bottles, smooth and maybe some ridges, some curling ribbons, whatever colors you like, and you need some jingle bells, optional, scissors, paper plates and you'll also need some kind of beets or seeds you can use rice i have popcorn seeds today or you could use beets uh, some centers don't allow you to use food if food is an issue but uh i'm gonna use popcorn seeds and of course our trusty hot glue gun so with that being said you ready oh yeah ready Let's and ready do this we are going to make some shaker. Ricardo is going to make the shaker with the, the water bottle. And I'm going to make shakers with paper plates. Mm. With two paper plates. First thing we need to do is get our seeds inside of our bottle and plate. Just hold it around it at the end, but if, if it gets uh, spilled like that, guys. Use a funnel. But yeah, but use a funnel. Oh, that's about enough. You put your cap back on. My turn. <laughs> I used too many. You pour some back in. Okay guys, he put his cap on, but I'm going to put hot glue around the edges of my paper plate. You gotta do it quickly because the hot glue will dry really fast. Oh yes, you guys, I just got it in my hand. Finger. Hurry up. regular glue at the school and just for extra security you can just staple around your plate this yeah. is like what we did when we made the maraca spider i will add a link to one of my old videos where i did the maraca spider okay shake it so far well guys what I'm gonna make uh, from the middle of the yellow part I'm gonna do is make a star from Ghana Africa while Ricardo is painting his star I'm gonna start cutting pieces of the curling ribbon to attach to my shaker and I'm gonna use about say like arms from my shoulder to arm length 
Finally, some red. I'm going to be attaching some jingle bells on them. There's a hole right there at the top where you could just slide the curling ribbon inside of there. If your curling ribbon is too fat, just fold it. And you'll be able to stick it through. See the hole? Just like that. Secure it with two knots. Alright guys. What you guys think? Looks pretty good. Hmm. I got my jingle bell tied onto my string. And now I'm going to attach it to the tamarind. This is the front. And this is the back. I just did some freestyle. Now we're gonna get ready to add the jingle bells on there. So the way you wanna do this, you want to uh, have the bells close together so that they can uh, bump against one another to make the noise. And once you have them all lined up pretty fairly close together, you're gonna tie them all in one group. like that. You're going to attach it to the back of your shaker. Cut it. And I'm going to secure it right where I put that knot. Tape it directly on the back of it. So this instrument has two sounds. And for extra security, you need to put some tape around the edges of your plate so that none of the seeds will spill out. Just go all around it. Yeah. <laughs> and you want to put some tape on the staples so that they won't poke those precious little fingers. All right, folks, that's it for the show. This is my shaker. Her drum, my drum. <laughs>